When I met Eileen, uh, Kevin was already in her life. I didn't get to witness the beginning of their love story, or and I don't have a you know magical story about how I paired them together or you know anything like that. But I've third wheeled them enough to witness their the true love that is Kevin and Eileen Perello. It is so deep and so meaningful, yet understated at the same time. It was such a small yet understated action and it really, really exemplified how well Eileen knew Kevin and his needs. And vice versa. Eileen gets to spend the rest of her life uh, in luxury with a man that finishes her food and doesn't mind eating her leftovers. I'm so blessed to have you both in my life. I love you both. A love and friendship that comes so naturally and is so deep should be celebrated. Back then, back in 2009, when Kevin and I were like, first became friends, Kevin was harder than man he is today. We were just dudes being dudes. We thought we were invincible. We were going on our little trips to wherever, trips to nowhere, yeah. late night adventures, and just the general shenanigans painting the town red. I heard about Eileen well before I met her, and it was never cool guy Kevin trying to be all nonchalant. From square one, it was apparent how much he cared for her and how much he was gonna make sure he got a chance with her and that he took that chance and shot his shot. And so it began. <laughs> from then until now, I saw Kevin change. He transitioned from a young man who feels invincible to being a grown man who knows he's not gonna last forever, but found someone who he can build something with that will last forever. He never was nonchalant or played it cool, and he loves his wife and he's not afraid to show it. I see that Kevin looks as happy as I've ever seen him sitting next to his beautiful bride. And Eileen, since day one, I've seen, I've seen the difference you've made in Kevin's life. I've seen the two of you grow together over the past eight years or so and can't help but feel pride and joy for both of you guys. You guys are strong individuals and are even stronger together. I mean, come on, the whole world shut down and that didn't stop you guys from marrying each other. <laughs> Tonight's just the beginning though. You have taken the first step of uh, building your lives together and we don't know what the future holds. There's going to be adversity and challenges, but just like the two of you getting married after the world stopped, no matter what the obstacle is, your guys' love for each other is always going to triumph. To the new Mr. and Mrs. Perello, you found a bond that is going to last forever and are now embarking on a journey of a lifetime. I promise to love you and always be by your side through all the ups and downs. I promise to always be faithful and always be your best friend no matter what the future might bring. I promise to help out with the chores at home and take care of you when you're sick. I promise to always choose you, to stand by your side and sleep in your arms to be the joy to your heart and food for your soul, to learn with you and grow with you, even as time and life changes us both. I promise to laugh with you in the good times and struggle alongside you in the bad times. I promise to respect and cherish you as an individual, a partner, and an equal. Today, I choose to spend the rest of my life with you. I promise to love you for who you are and for you, who you are yet to become. And that includes your loud snoring. <laughs> I promise to be patient and to remember that all things between us are always rooted to love. I promise to nurture your dreams and to help you reach them. I promise to share my whole heart with you 
and to remember to show you how deeply I care for you, no matter the challenges that come our way. I promise to love you loyally and fiercely as long as I live. We met from a mutual friend who were organizing a flash mob. I'll never forget the moment you noticed me. I wanted to impress you with my, my dance skills and I couldn't wait, have waited to have the opportunity to speak to you. After a month, I knew I wanted you to be my girlfriend and one day my wife. I never thought that going to do a flash mob was going to change my life, but turns out it was the best decision I've ever made. Now you're my best friend, my confidant, and my forever plus one. Instead of waking up to your good morning texts, I can wake up to your good mornings in person for the rest of our lives. You've given me the time and the space to grow into a better person, and I wouldn't have been able to do it without you. Kevin and Eileen, it is with such joy that I now send you out into the world to spread this beautiful light that you share with those around you. By the power vested in me, I now for the first time pronounce you husband and wife, you may kiss the bride.